The trigger valve works with the head valve to fire your nail gun. When the trigger valve is pressed, it creates a differential in the air pressure between the air reservoir and the cylinder. This causes the head valve to open, which fires the piston. The most common issue with the trigger valve is failure of the O-rings inside of it. When this occurs, air can leak from the trigger and often the gun won't fire. Replacing the trigger valve assembly is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. I'll begin by removing the trigger from the nail gun. The trigger is secured to the gun with a pin, and the pin is held in place with a small O-ring. I'll use a small punch and hammer to remove the pin. And then I can pull the trigger away from the nail gun. The trigger valve is held in place with two roll pins, and I'll drive those out with the punch. With the pins removed, now I can remove the valve. Often it'll come out in more than one piece. Now I can install the new trigger valve. I'll apply a small amount of grease to the O-rings. And then slide the new valve into the gun. You want to make sure that the lever is pointed towards the rear of the gun. Once the valve is in place, I'll re-secure it with the roll pins. And I'll finish up by reinstalling the trigger. The wire spring on the back of the trigger should pass over the post on the trigger valve. I'll use my punch to help align the trigger to the body. And I'll secure the pin with the O-ring. 